Hey, how's it going? This is Shane, uh, BR Pacific Motorsports. Uh, we're really excited to be uh, representing this 1992 Bronco. Um, the car thing's a fun gig for me, but I'm actually a full-time firefighter as well. And this is one of the guys I work with uh, who's getting ready to retire. This is his Bronco and we're helping him sell this. Uh, so this is a 92 Bronco. It has 2,520 miles on it. Um, we're gonna do a walk around on this. It's it's absolutely unreal. This is a new car. Um, so it's sitting on the original tires. Um, normally we do a walk around on the flaws on this vehicle, um, but there isn't there isn't any. Um, absolutely everything's original. Um, sold new out of Vermont. Um, the original owner passed away, went into a family um, trust. Uh, they consigned it with a gentleman back there and uh, our, our good friend purchased this. Um, he had planned to use this through retirement at his cabin in Montana. Um, basically figured out this is just way too nice, way too original um, for him to take to Montana and kind of chew up. So we're going to do a walk around on this, um, show you everything on it. It's absolutely unreal. Um, we're, we're excited to, to see what it does here on Bring a Trailer. Um, we're sitting on original tires, original hubcaps. Um, we did a good video underneath. Every sticker is present. Um, axle tags, rear bumper tags, every little sticker is there. Um, you know, normally I'd, I kind of point out little flaws here and there, um, but there, there isn't any, any on this thing. Um, just, just absolutely nothing. So this is, uh, certainly kind of collector quality here. You can see it's a base model. So it's vinyl floors, vinyl seats, uh, roll up windows, um, no headliner, just as clean as it gets. We'll show you the, the back seat here. Um, again, everything's, you know, brand new. We'll keep walking around back here. Um, again, just trying to find any kind of flaw or anything on it. There just isn't isn't anything there. Um, it's got full Marty report. It's one of I think 417 with these options, colors, and uh, code. So real rare, kind of little Bronco. Um, yeah, normally I'm kind of pointing stuff out on flaws on this, but there I mean there isn't anything on this. You know, with 2,500 miles, not uh, not a ton to talk about. Uh, it's never been stored outside. It's all, all original glass. Um, it's got all the original books, everything with it. Uh, you can see there on the windshield is the original, uh, or one of the, the latest, what they called the, what Vermont did the mileage checks where it had 1,900 miles on it. And... Uh, 2006. Show you, it's even got still the selling dealerships original ice scraper, original pen. Um, everything's brand new on this. So, All right, so uh, video accidentally got cut off a little bit, our uh, high quality uh, film working skills. So we'll do a quick walk around, kind of back down this side. I know we covered it in the initial video, um, but we kind of glanced over the, the back here. Um, again, normally I spend a lot of time kind of walking around and making sure people are aware of any flaws or anything they have, but this, this just doesn't have <laughs> any. Um, it's absolutely un, unreal, I'm gonna keep saying that. Um, original spare, nothing's been out of this rig, um, you can see. Um, power rear window um, on it, um, you can see there isn't, let's see if I can even find a scratch on this, maybe some really tiny, tiny light scratches here, um, but nothing anywhere on it. So we'll get uh, the hood opened up on it, we'll do a quick drive on it, um, and then uh, Chat about a little more.
All right, so we're gonna do a quick dry video. Um, we're gonna fire this thing up. This is the uh, you know inline six manual. Um, I'm sure the the purists out there that know these better than me. Um, everything's original on this, with the exception of the battery. Obviously, would have had the Ford Motorcraft battery. Um, I've had a bunch of low mile Fox body stuff, so kind of know my way around this stuff fairly well. Um, you can see all the stamps are there on everything. You can see the original date stamp uh, chalk marks here on the fan shroud. Um, everything's correct as it should be. Um, to my knowledge, the only thing that's been changed on this is the battery um, and fluids on it. So we're going to fire this up. We're going to take it on a short drive, uh, chat about it a little bit and uh, get going. Some of our finest work here on this video. All right, so we're gonna take it for a quick drive. Uh, you can see the current mileage is 2538.4. So everything, I mean, again, it's basically a brand new car. It's, it's pretty crazy. It's a base model rig, so no AC, anything like that to check. Uh, you can see the rear power window going up. Everything working just fine on it. Um, again, everything's brand, you know, really brand new. The lights work, everything works, radio works. Um, we do have a reserve set on this one. Um, should be a fun one. We're excited to see what it does. Normally, you know, our, uh, our kind of spiel on this is get in it and drive it home. This one, mechanically, absolutely no issues driving it home. It's a brand new car. Um, it is sitting on original tires and, you know, all of that. So if anybody was wanting to, to jump in this thing and drive it home, there would be some concerns. Uh, Joe does have a set of tires that come with it um, on uh, different rims. So those will be included with it. Um, we'll get it up to speed here. Everything works, drives great. Um, so this should be a really fun auction. We're looking really forward to representing this rig. I sold a bunch of F-250s on here and clean low mile Fords. Um, and I followed the, the Bronco and Ford market closely. And uh, I think this is gonna be a really fun one. This is collector grade um, that would certainly be worthy of sitting in someone's collection. Um, so best of luck. We'll be available all auction to answer any questions anybody has. Got a ton of photos on this, um, and we're looking forward to uh, seeing where it ends up. It gets the call home. All right, take care. Hey, what's up, man? How are you? Good.